The following is a paid commercial presentation for Imagine Golf. I can control the club a lot easier, and I especially just like the loft, the height of it. Throw it in divots, throw it in the rough, put it in the sand, just anything you want, just pops it right out. It's amazing. You see a two or three shot reduction in my handicap. Conservatively, three or four strokes around. I'd save two or three shots with this club. Any improvement in my golf game is worth a lot to me. Hi, this is Jay Randolph for Imagine Golf. I'm going to tell you an exciting story about a revolutionary golf club that will change the way you think about hitting those difficult long iron shots. It's called the middle club. Middle clubs are much easier to hit than your long irons and much easier to control than your fairway woods. There's nothing like it. With the middle club, you'll get long iron distance with short iron confidence. Guaranteed to lower your score or your money back. I've never hit shots like this. Not with any club I've ever had in my bag. The middle club has taken that middle gap, my no man's land of golf, and turned it into a place where I can score and I can make shots. Did you know the longer the shaft, the more your small mistakes are magnified? Any error in your grip or swing means a major problem at the end of a long shaft. That's why long irons and fairway woods are so hard to hit, and that's why they can be so inconsistent. With a longer shaft, small miss hits become big problems. But because the middle club has a shorter shaft, the variations and small mistakes in your swing are minimized or completely eliminated. The result is a shot that puts you on the green putting for birdie rather than in a bunker or hazard like you might be with a long iron or a hard to control fairway wood. The middle club's patent pending system combines a shorter shaft with a heavier Cobalt 57 club head. It has one of the lowest centers of gravity in golf. It's been proven that a metal wood club is easier to hit and more forgiving than a cavity back iron. Take the hardest to hit long irons in your bag, whether it's the two, three, or four iron, and replace it with a middle club two, three, or four. It will become your favorite club. Now let's join our host, Super Bowl quarterback and NFL MVP Joe Theismann, and five-time PGA Tour winner and television golf analyst Bill Kratzer. Billy, there's that middle area mm -hmm. where I try and get a club in my hand, and I look down at fairway, and I'm sure everybody out there does exactly the same thing. You look down the fairway and think, geez, you know, I, I know I have to hit this club, but boy, I don't have any confidence in doing it. it. The middle club solves that range and that problem. Well, it does, Joe, and you're out there to shoot a score. You're not out there to see how long you can hit it. You're out there to post a number on the scorecard. And you know, you get into that range where you have to hit a two, a three, a four iron, you know, that's very difficult unless you're playing every day. If you get into a situation where you have to hit a fairway wood, mm -hmm. but yet it's not quite the distance that you hit that fairway wood, so now you have to choke down, you're not gonna hit a good shot. And you're right, the middle club does solve that because now, instead of hitting the length of a two iron shaft, now you have maybe the length of a seven iron or a six iron, so it becomes much easier to hit. And then the confidence factor for the amateur goes considerably higher. You have more confidence in, in yourself, I guess, and of course the club is what gives you that confidence. Being a little short of shaft and uh, the loft that's on it, it, it makes it easier to, to control the, 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 the ball flight, which means you're going to be more consistent. To lower your score, you need a club that can get you on the green from those difficult long iron distances. Here's how the middle club saves you strokes. Your tee shot leaves you with what would normally be a difficult long iron shot. But you know you're inconsistent with your long irons. They're difficult to hit because the shafts are too long. You could try choking down on a fairway wood, but the combination of its longer shaft and lighter club head doesn't give you the control you need. The answer is the middle club. Its shorter shaft combined with its heavier Cobalt 57 club head help you hit the ball straight with a perfect trajectory to land softly on the green. This is the kind of control that will have you putting for birdie, and depending on your handicap, you'll save two to four strokes and lower your score. Guaranteed or your money back. I'm standing here with a shot that's pretty intimidating whether you're an amateur or a pro. You have a shot that you have to carry the water, you have bunkers on the left, and you want to try to keep the ball on the green. And it's somewhere in that three iron range for me. But I'm going to choose to use the middle club three simply because it's shorter, and because of the head weight, I'm going to be able to hit it just as far, if not farther. But the beauty of the middle club three is that I'm going to be more accurate. I'm more accurate, and yet I don't lose any distance whatsoever. And I promise you, you at home, the first time you use this, you'll gain that confidence also. 
If not, it's a money back guarantee. Let me explain why a shorter shaft gives you better control and consistency. Let's use the example of pounding a nail with a hammer. If you have a short handle on that hammer, you're going to be able to hit the head of that nail quite consistently and accurately. If you lengthen that handle, it's going to be more difficult. That same principle applies in the game of golf. The shorter the shaft, the better opportunity you're going to have to be able to accurately hit the ball, to control your swing, and to be more confident and consistent with what you need to do to shoot better scores. I remember the first time I hit this club, just a few days ago. It was into a howling wind on a par three about this size, made birdie. I don't think I would even been on the green with the other clubs. First time I hit it, I, uh, I hit a prototype about six months ago and intentionally was asked to hit it off a down lie or a divot and then out a deep rough with the lead-in thought of just swing the club, let the club do the work. And that's where I was most impressed. I hit it as well as I would hit any shot out of that lie ever. Well, I was in the woods off the tee, and I hit the ball out of a pretty bad lie on the green, made par. The four of us were in the bunker. I was the only one that was on the green. The rest of them were short of the green, and they were all hitting, you know, four irons and three irons and things like that. So with this club right here, I made a birdie, took the hole, and eventually took their money. <laughs> How does the middle club stack up against the other clubs in your bag? We went to a top independent facility to try the middle club against the leading fairway woods and long irons. We wanted to see just how accurate each club could be. We hit multiple balls on the center of each club. Time and again, the middle club had a tighter dispersion pattern than some of the leading fairway woods like Orlemar and Adams by an amazing average of 49%. And the leading long irons like Ping and TaylorMade by a whopping average of 61%. With today's greens surrounded by water hazards and bunkers, what would you pay for a club that would give you a 61% tighter pattern? The middle club will give you more control, better accuracy, and a lower score. Now you can take your most dreaded club out of your bag and replace it with one that will soon become your favorite, the middle club. You've just seen what the robot test can do. Now wait until you hear what people have to say about how it affects their game. It's very forgiving. Very forgiving. It's uh, almost like you didn't miss hit it. I've hit a couple of the new metal woods, the Orlemar and the Adams and those kind of things, but they're regular wood-sized clubs. What surprised me about this is I play it like it's an iron. I play it like it's a five iron or a six iron, and it feels more comfortable than the irons do when you swing because it's got that heavier head. That's, I think that makes a big difference. What happens to your accuracy and distance control when you find yourself in deep rough? The lie's not good enough to hit a long iron, and there's little hope of controlling the distance with a fairway wood. Now let five-time PGA Tour winner and television golf analyst Bill Kratzert show you how the middle club can lower your score even out of deep rough. Well, so many times, you know, you'll drive the ball into the rough and, and you find your ball down here and you really don't catch a clean lie. When a player comes up and he sees a lie like that, sees the green some 200 yards away, you'd have trouble getting a seven wood through it. You're certainly not going to get a three or a four iron through it. You're going to be able to use the middle club with this type of lie, you're going to be able to go down there, dig it out, get it out of the grass, elevate it into the air, and hold the green. Let me demonstrate. You've seen what a pro can do. You've seen what a robot can do. Stay tuned to see how the middle club performs with golfers just like you. Yes. Yes. Plus, let's find out why Joe Theismann's so excited. Unbelievable. Even good golfers have trouble hitting their long irons, and it's even more difficult to choke down on a fairway wood to hit a long iron distance. Now there's a solution to the problem, the revolutionary middle club. It's easier to hit than a long iron and much easier to control than a fairway wood. The middle club with its shorter shaft gives you better control of your shots and helps minimize mistakes we're all prone to make. Now miss hits from fairway woods and long irons that would have left you in a bunker can be eliminated. With a middle club, you can avoid those annoying hooks and slices and be on the green putting for birdie. Plus, we guarantee you'll lower your score or your money back. The question you might have is, why does the shorter middle club three go as far, if not further, than the three iron you already have? Because of the shorter shaft, you're able to put more weight into the head. So you're going to be able to have the feel of the clubs you already have in your bag. It's going to be a normal feel. You're going to be able to get the distance that you normally would get with a three iron, but you're going to have the accuracy of a short iron. 
The combination of the middle club shorter shaft and heavier Cobalt 57 head and power pack trampoline-like club face gives you feel, control, and accuracy that will astound you. Never before has such a dynamic combination existed. Never before has there been a club that delivers such accuracy consistently. And never before could you so easily play shots from those difficult long iron distances with such amazing feel, control, and accuracy. At that 180, 160, 170 yards to the green, I was so inconsistent that I had no idea where the ball was going. With this club, I'm more consistent around the green versus being in the woods, right, left, wherever. And when you're more consistent around the green, you're gonna take a few more strokes off your game. The middle clubs feature a specially designed ultralight steel shaft for better consistency and control, and are also available with a high performance graphite shaft. When you set up with the middle club, you're closer to the ball, so your miss hits are minimized, so you'll end up on the green instead of in a hazard. The middle club's lower center of gravity gives you an ideal launch angle to propel you out of any lie, whether it's rough, bunkers, hard pan, or divots. It also creates the optimal trajectory and spin for a softer landing, so your ball lands on the green and stays on the green. When you're forced to hit a long iron, the length of the shaft causes a lack of control. The new driving irons like Rescue, Baffler, and PRGR have lighter club heads and longer shafts, so your tiniest mistakes can be magnified. Fairway woods amplify your mistakes even more because their longer shafts cause even bigger inconsistencies and problems with distance control. But the middle club's shorter shaft combined with a heavier Cobalt 57 head and trampoline-like club face cause the ball to drive straight through the wind with a perfect trajectory to land softly on the green. This is the kind of distance and control that will have you putting for birdie rather than playing out of a hazard. Depending on your handicap, the middle club will lower your score two to four strokes per round or your money back. We can replace the corresponding irons that you have in your bag because we offer six models, one through six. Now, I want you to think about that iron that is your nemesis, the one that you hate. You can replace that with the middle club. And I can promise you, because it's shorter, has more head weight, and it's easier to hit, that club, the middle club, is going to become your favorite club. You have nothing to lose but strokes off your score. Have your credit card ready and call the number on your screen now. No matter which iron you have the most difficulty hitting, from the one through the sixth, you can now replace it with a corresponding numbered middle club. Because most golfers have trouble hitting their three iron, we recommend you replace it with a middle club three. The middle club is yours for only four easy payments of $39.95 and with a 60-day stroke saver guarantee you can't lose. But that's not all. If you order now, you'll get our Straight Down the Middle Golf Tips tape with five-time PGA Tour winner and television golf analyst Bill Kratzert, plus a custom-made head cover. Together, a $39.95 value. Yours free if you call now. Put the middle club in your bag and get the distance and consistency you've always wanted with your long irons, but with the accuracy, control, and confidence of your short irons. Call now. There's nothing like it. The middle club. Long iron distance, short iron confidence. That middle area we were talking about, the middle range for the middle club, it seems like that's the area where if I'm having trouble scoring, that's where I start to add the numbers. The shorter part, I can keep them down. Getting off the tees, okay, but that middle area is where I really start to add the numbers. Well, no one's really gone into this area, Joe, and until the middle club came, it was so difficult to get people to hit twos, threes, four irons, even five irons, and maybe six irons to get it on the green let alone close to the hole. So with the middle club, now they have a chance because now it's like they're hitting a short iron. They go into that scoring zone. And when you're able to put the ball on the green as opposed to the right or left, short or long, when you're putting for birdies, that's a lot better opportunity to make birdies as opposed to trying to get it up and down. It does help you reduce the score. Absolutely. To see how the middle club performs out on the course, we ask golfers to try the middle club head to head against their clubs. First, they hit 10 shots with their clubs using orange balls, then 10 shots with a middle club using white balls. The middle club helped Bob Shearer tighten up his pattern by an amazing 49%. I hit it great. It was the most unbelievable shot you can imagine. Bill Brokema improved his pattern with the middle club by a whopping 77%. Much easier than the long irons or mid, even the mid irons. It's just easy to hit. I mean, I can't hit a long iron that high anymore. Not like that. Even a scratch golfer like Nick Papadakis improved his dispersion pattern by 11%. I can't believe how easy it is to hit. Oh, it's very consistent. 
one after the other. Even the misses are, are better. You know, we had a lot of misses. <laughs> the middle club really helped a 15 handicapper like Dwight Strickland. He tightened his pattern by a humongous 69%. It's so much easier to hit. It's so much more solid when you swing it. You're working with a shorter shaft. It's got a lot more loft to it. It's got better consistency. Even a low handicapper like Doug Bedard was able to improve his pattern by an unbelievable 75%. It gives you the right tools in the scoring zone where you want. I mean, I've only been hitting this club now for five minutes, but I, I already feel confident with it, whereas three iron I've been playing for 30 years and I still don't feel confident with it. Player after player was amazed at the consistent distance and tighter patterns that the middle club produced. It not only performs well in player tests, but also in robotic testing, it proved to be as much as 61% tighter than some of the top name competitors. You can even get those tight patterns when hitting from some really tough spots. Now Joe Theismann shows you how the middle club helps him get out of a tough situation in a fairway bunker. We've all been in this situation before. Here I am, fairway bunker. Got myself a pretty long shot. What do I hit out of the bunker? Well, you know, I'd, I'd probably like to get, get my longer iron out. But I just don't know if I can get it in the air. I'm not sure I can get it out of here clean. If I catch it a little heavy, it's going to wind up going short. If I catch it a little thin, I may not get it over the lip. But if I use the middle club, first of all, I look at it and I say, I've got some confidence in this club. I've been hitting it well. I think it's terrific out of the sand. The ball is sitting up well for me. I can position myself, set myself up, and just put a normal swing and feel very confident to know that I can get that club head on the ball. Look at the height. Look at the trajectory. And look at the ball land. It lands soft on the green. I've never hit shots like this, not with any club I've ever had in my bag. The middle club has taken that middle gap, my no man's land of golf, and turned it into a place where I can score and I can make shots. If I can make shots in that middle area, then I can lower my scores. Joe did something he could never do before. He hit three in a row on the green from a fairway bunker. I hit three on the green, I hit three on the green. Unbelievable. You must be I am. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm thrilled. I'm delighted. And I am surprised. I mean, I've never, ever, I've never felt this good about the sand. I mean, I've never felt good about sand. Sure, I loved it at the beach, just like you. <laughs> but I wouldn't really look forward to it on a golf course. And for me out here, it's just, and you know, the biggest thing, I think the most important thing you have to understand is the length of the club is what really is giving me the confidence. You've seen the pros on TV use the three wood from off the edge of the green. Well, you have a three wood, then you have the middle club. You can see the difference in length. So it only makes sense that this shot's gonna become much easier with the middle club. Because of the shorter shaft, you're gonna be able to stand closer to it. And because you wanna to try to hit this shot as though you were putting, you're gonna be able to get closer to it Get your eyes centered over the ball. So the technique that you use in putting, you're going to be able to use with the middle club from off the edge of the green. As you see, the middle club is versatile enough to get you out of a number of tough situations. And it's the solution to your problem with the long irons. You and I have a problem area that's very similar. It's that middle distance area. What do you do with it? How do you solve the problem? Do you choke down on a wood? Well, I'm not sure that I have as much control as I want. Do I use the longer irons? I haven't been able to hit them very well. The middle club will get it done for you. The middle club gives you accuracy. It gives you consistency. It allows you to hit the ball from that middle distance onto the green, which will help your scores. I have four clubs that I might hit the three iron distance. First, I have the fairway wood. Well, I'm gonna to have to choke up on it. Hard to hit, hard to control. I'm probably gonna miss the green. Next, I have the tailor-made rescue. It too has a longer shaft, hard to control, probably another missed green. Now my former three iron, it too has a longer shaft, hard to control, very slight chance of hitting the green. But with the shorter middle club, because it is shorter, the shorter shaft and more head weight, I'm gonna gain accuracy and I'm not gonna lose any distance. Just stand there, stay down on the ball and just make a good swing. You don't have to think about distance, trajectory, the lie, you just swing the golf club. And the shorter shaft helps you stay down on the shot and the results just happen. If you have trouble with those long par three holes, stay tuned. Joe will show you how to get off the tee and onto the green with the middle club, the revolutionary middle club. 
more consistent and much easier to hit than the long iron with much more control than a fairway wood. You can control the club more easily because the shorter shaft minimizes the mistakes that we're all prone to make. Now miss hits from fairway woods or long irons that would have left you in a bunker can be eliminated. With the middle club, you can avoid those annoying hooks and slices and be on the green putting for birdie. Plus, we'll guarantee you'll lower your score or your money back. The middle club's patent-pending combination of a shorter shaft and heavier Cobalt 57 head, plus the power pack trampoline-like club face, gives you the feel, control, and accuracy that will completely astound you. Never before has such a dynamic combination existed. Never before has there been a club that delivers such accuracy consistently. Never before could you so easily play shots from those difficult long iron distances with such amazing feel, control, and accuracy. You know, I'm not kidding. I, I've never hit a ball consistently in, in that straight. I just haven't. Uh, I, it just amazes me. The middle clubs feature a specially designed ultralight steel shaft for better consistency and control, and are also available with a high-performance graphite shaft. When you set up with a middle club, you're closer to the ball, so your miss hits are minimized and you end up on the green instead of in a hazard. The middle club's lower center of gravity gives you an ideal launch angle to propel you out of any lie, whether it's rough, bunkers, hard pan, or divots. It also creates the optimal trajectory and spin for a softer landing, so your ball lands on the green and stays on the green. This is the kind of control that leaves you putting for birdie. Depending on your handicap, you will save two to four strokes per round, or your money back, guaranteed. We can replace the corresponding irons that you have in your bag because we offer six models, one through six. Now, I want you to think about that iron that is your nemesis, the one that you hate. You can replace that with the middle club. And I can promise you, because it's shorter, has more headway, and it's easier to hit, that club, the middle club, is going to become your favorite club. You have nothing to lose but strokes off your score. Have your credit card ready and call the number on your screen now. No matter which iron you have the most difficulty hitting, from the one through the sixth, you can now replace it with a corresponding numbered middle club. Because most golfers have trouble hitting their three iron, we recommend you replace it with a middle club three. The middle club is yours for only four easy payments of $39.95. And with the 60-day stroke saver guarantee, you can't lose. But that's not all. If you order now, you'll get our Straight Down the Middle Golf Tips tape with five-time PGA Tour winner and television golf analyst Bill Kratzert, plus a custom-made head cover, together a $39.95 value, yours free if you call now. Put the middle club in your bag and get the distance and consistency you've always wanted with your long irons, but with the accuracy, control, and confidence of your short irons. Call now. There's nothing else like it. The middle club, long iron distance, short iron confidence. The first time you put this in your hand, the difference is absolutely incredible. Because you don't have to make any adjustments in your swing, Joe. I mean, you can set down the middle club and start hitting it right away with no swing adjustments. It's like you're hitting a shorter iron, a seven, a six, a five, as opposed to going and trying to get a two or three or four iron up in the air. The, the three iron, again, I tend to have a little bit of, you know, trepidation from hitting it, because, you know, just the length of it and the, the, the loft is not very much, so you, you tend to think you might you know, hit it bad, so to speak. So that I just had no, you know, I just, I felt like it was a little shorter and had a little more loft to it. And when I hit it, it just, I mean, it just floated. Almost on any golf course, whether it be your own or someplace you might be playing, there's gonna be a long par three like this. For me, a, a three iron is what I would usually use. A Little bit of breeze in my face. I'm looking at this distance. I'm thinking to myself, okay, I look down here. I know I don't hit this very well. I haven't hit it very well. So my concern are the bunkers on the right, the narrowness of the fairway. I think to myself, all right, I can, I can do this. For me, it's just a problem mentally. I wind up hitting it a little thin, and I never really get to the sweet spot on the club. It doesn't have consistency. It doesn't have accuracy. And in this case, it certainly doesn't have the distance. Now, I have the middle club. The middle club now, I can stand with it. I know I can hit this thing more accurately. I know I can hit it more consistently. And I know when it lands, it'll have the trajectory that I'm looking for and the distance I need. And I don't have to wonder when I get over the ball. All I do is set and fire. And the accuracy of it, and as it lands, it lands soft. 
It allows you to get closer to the ball and allows you to be more accurate and still create the distance. I think that's something you really have to understand is I can hit this club as long as I can hit the trouble irons I have, that middle set of irons that exist in our bag. They're all there. We have something for the short game. We certainly have something for the long game. But what do you have for that middle range problem, that problem area? You have the middle club, and there's nothing like it. That's without any warm-up. Look how many of them are up there by the pin. I mean, that's, I don't think I could do that with a long iron. I really don't. With this one, I can get it up in the air. I, it takes a lot less effort, a lot less effort. and uh, that way there's less to go wrong with my swing. I hit it good. Yeah. I hit it a lot more consistent than the two iron with much less effort. Renowned golf instructor Peter Croker is one of the few teaching pros to make the cover of Golf Digest. But even he learned a few things about how the middle club can help your game. I'm actually very amazed. It's certainly going to help a professional play a better game of golf from 200 yards in. It's, it's, and uh, that's one thing. But I think the higher handicap golf is going to get a lot more out of it. It'll take lots of shots off their score. How would you like to hit the green from those difficult long iron distances? Now you can without even changing your swing. The middle club is like nothing you've ever played with before. Now you don't have to choke down on a fairway wood or cross your fingers and try to hit a long iron. Over and over again, the middle club will get you where you want to be, on the green putting for birdie. The very first time you swing the middle club, you'll hit the best long iron shot you ever played. In tests, the middle club outperformed woods by 49% and irons by an amazing 61%, giving you an accurate shot consistently. You have nothing to lose but strokes off your score. Have your credit card ready and call the number on your screen now. No matter which iron you have the most difficulty hitting, from the one through the sixth, you can now replace it with a corresponding numbered middle club. Because most golfers have trouble hitting their three iron, we recommend you replace it with the middle club three. The middle club is yours for only four easy payments of $39.95. And with the 60-day stroke saver guarantee, you can't lose. But that's not all. If you order now, you get our Straight Down the Middle Golf Tips tape with five-time PGA Tour winner and television golf analyst Bill Kratzert, plus a custom-made head cover. Together, a $39.95 value. Yours free if you call now. Put the middle club in your bag and get the distance and consistency you've always wanted with your long irons, but with the accuracy, control, and confidence of your short irons. Call now. There's nothing else like it. The Middle Club. Long iron distance. Short iron confidence. I'm going to guarantee you something. You're going to buy this club. Now, you're either going to buy it now or you're going to buy it at the 19th hole when you're handing somebody else the money that has this club that has used it. So it's really up to you. You make the decision. It's guaranteed money back. Now, the question is, are you going to get the money or is somebody else going to get it? It really feels like it just takes off of the club head, you know? It's no, there's no effort there. It would definitely reduce the strokes. This is, it's very consistent. The middle club can help you be more consistent, more accurate, and put the ball where you want on the green. I'd give my eye teeth to have a club like that. Can I keep this? I missed that ball. Yeah, but where are you? Right in the green. With this club right here, I made a birdie, took the hole, and eventually took their money. <laughs>